Hey, how are you doing? I am here in my kitchen and I'm about to make up a soup for you. I hope you're feeling as good as I am. I know I'm loving life. I'm very glad to be here with you. Had a really wonderful day. So yeah, I'm going to share with you a celery, cilantro, basil soup. It's going to have a little flair. I'm going to add some cayenne and some garlic. Cayenne is optional in this recipe. Or if you just want to put a little and see if you want some more, just like I always express to do with the salt. You want enough to bring out the flavor. You want enough salt, that is, to bring out the flavor. Some people don't want too much salt. Some people need a little bit more. Same with the cayenne. So, let me get started. Woo! Woo! Ha! <laughs> Just kidding. I have everything here. So, I'm going to start with three cups of structured, filtered, or spring water. It's always important to have really good alkaline water. This just so happens to be really incredible well water. So, three cups of water in a high power powered blender preferred, which would be a Vitamix or a Blendtec. There are a few others. If all you have is a regular blender, please, by all means, just use it. So, I'm going to put about a cup of cilantro, about a half a cup of basil, of course I put the stems in because I'm blending it up and there's no need to waste the stems of herbs when you're blending up soups, sauces, anything that will that the Vitamix or Blendtec or the blender will actually cream up or will blend up, just go ahead and put them in there. Now I'm going to put two stalks of celery. I'm going to now add half of a Haas avocado. This is a really easy way to open an avocado. Just don't do this part at home. This part's easy. See how I chopped into the pit and then twisted? Voila. So, I will scoop out with a spoon, very simply, scoop out half of the avocado. Put it into the blender. An another good trick when using a knife, because I'm going to be taking a clove of garlic, and when I press, putting it upon my cutting board, when I press against it, it will take the shell, the outer layer, basically take it off. So all I gotta do is go, and it's gone. And then all I gotta do is throw it into the blender. So, at this point, I'm gonna add a good amount of cayenne myself because I really wanna get the spice, really wanna get in there and clear out any mucus or anything that's in there in my sinuses. As I was talking about earlier today, I was a little mucusy but from all the chocolate and the dehydrated stuff that I ate at the expo. So I threw in a bit of bit of cayenne there. Now, simply, I'm just going to add to my desired taste. With this, it'll probably be about a quarter of a teaspoon of this says sea salt but it's pink Himalayan salt. I prefer pink Himalayan salt, although sea salt, any type of salt that's not your table iodized salt, you don't want. So, I know about how much I'm gonna use. Start with a quarter te teaspoon, and then if you need a little more, add a little more.
like using it as a musical instrument because other than that, it would be a little bit of an, an annoying tool. Ah, since I'm just going to use this for myself, me, myself, and my lovely eye, I'm just going to taste it like this. Mmm. It's really good. I think I want a little bit spicier though. So I'm gonna put a little more cayenne in it. I wish I had some habanero, but I left my skateboard at my friend's house so I wasn't able to stop by the store on the way back. But luckily, and, very, and as a very blessed being, I had an, a ride by an angel. Thank you. You know what, I think I'm going to put a little chipotle, give it a little bit of a different hot spice. I love com com combining peppers and spices and herbs. Yum! Maybe I give myself a green mustache. Did that work? I don't know. It sure tastes good. Well, there you have it. There you just saw me create something in my kitchen. That was completely downloaded. Straight from creator. The divine being. Entity. Life force. Universe. However you want to call it. God. My higher power, channeled through my heart, with lots of true love, to share with you. And I truly appreciate you. Alkalize your body. Eat raw living foods as much as possible. Take it easy on yourself. Love yourself. And know that everything is in perfect order. Don't torture yourself. Just give yourself love and take it moment by moment. Take life day by day. That being said... One deep breath in, deep breath releasing. I love you so much. Mm. Mm.